Hi, welcome back to World of Ice Free. No, we're not currently at war. We are finishing off a couple of heavy cruisers above our glass. And then we are going to see what we can do with tech wise. I'm going to build up a bit more cash because designing a battleship is expensive. The Bally Almanac. I've done that thing of the event. There we go. Explosive shells. I'm not too bad in puzzle ships. Heavy cruisers, I do need a load more. Just to pull out a little bit on the expensive side. But I'm not buying terrible ones there. There's a fire improvement, it's sub warfare. Better 11 inch guns, that's a game changer. Do we have anything with 11 inches at the moment? No. But it looks like we're going to be building a new ship type in a couple of months. There's 11 inches. Okay, that's the competition. These compressed air. They got three central line turrets, they are very close to dreadnoughts. 4,000 commissioned. And they're building a light cruiser like that. So, rangefinder. I would like another type of armor cruiser. With the 11 inch. So, the 11 inch at 13,000 can penetrate 6 inches of armor. Compared to 4 over the 10. Or 6.5 for the 12. So the 12, though, are 500 tons heavier than the 11s. Backed up with 7s in turrets. Take that down a little bit. Let's save some weight off this thing. 23 knots is good. Built armor needs to go up to about 8 inches. Torix is fine. Normal medium range. Normal freeboard. Creep that up a little bit. Gives us some space for upgrades anyway. Oh, we can build battle cruisers. That will kick off a deer race, wouldn't it? Okay. Four months should be fine. Gives us a few weeks to build up some income. So now only using 12 inch guns on those. Oh my God. Britain, you got old nine and ten inch guns. And they've lost a lot of battleships already. They're putting dreadnoughts. Can we design a dreadnought? Too many and or heavy sacrifice. But yeah, that's fine. I don't care about that. It's 11 inches. Four and a half. 19 speed is terrible. 10 inch, fine. It's a pre dreadnought there still. Yeah, we can't build a dreadnought. We will have to go for the first battle cruiser. Avoid fine entanglements. We've already got an out to our line exists. We don't need S3 lines, center line toys. Alright. Now we should go to design a battleship. 
a dreadnought class. Or aft, uh, aft center line. Forward center line. Oh, it's got the two wing turrets there. Oh, that's good. That thing's packing eight and ten, ten eleven inch guns. Fourteen secondaries, no tertiaries, but the tips, those should be good enough. It will cost us two thousand a month. Oh yeah. Could add a bit more tonnage, just to give us some leeway. Yeah, the liberty. Okay. Dreadnought here has begun. Go for the win. Get some prestige. Half a chance of war with Germany. Looking pretty good. We'll get the budget. We need the budget now. Those are all basics. Yeah, fitness laid down over false class. Go to the build screen. Get one of these. And then hopefully you can get two Liberty class. Better eight inch. Yeah, great business laid down, Jeremy's laid down. Not here because it's not actually here. Push us behind though, but we're gonna catch up next. Yeah, the repulse has been finished. Increase our cooperation with Great Britain. Uh, Japan can handle their own troubles. 700 destroyers. Build screen. Two of those. And hopefully we can make up the 900 a month. Destruction improves. Yeah, see, we're going to make this. Get the budget tension, I think we can afford one more. Yep, we have to be a little bit more careful. Don't exactly want war. America's making me Lapras class. Oops, fast, but oh well, torpedo protection. With that wonderful thing that any ship you build is now going to be outdated by the time it leaves the dock. Japan and Russia might be going to war. Right. Bunch of old 1890, 89 stuff. Yeah, that's what we're missing. A bunch of obsolete night like, cruisers. That are costing us a good amount. These sapphire classes. Costing us a huge amount of money, so we will scrap the two Brannis classes. We will scrap those as well. And we will hopefully be able to get rid of these two. I will take the hit. Yeah, we'll scrap a load of obsolete ships. Can't scrap. Got these. We might be able to do a rebuild on the Bruce class. Twenty knots running eight-inch guns. 
Irgendwie der, der ist jetzt nicht ganz... Ah, das ist cool, cool, das ist... Alright, let's get back from them. Okay. I'm okay with some obsolete ones. Be stupid to learn that. Let's design a new light cruiser. Using five inch guns everywhere, apparently. No, I don't. And that'll take a while to fix. 25 knots is good, 4,000 tons. Doesn't cost too much a month. So the that's got a range of 9,000 yards and penetrates 2 inches. 2.6, but adds more weight. Look at these as raiders. We should be able to build a few of those. Got stick fire. The Emperor and Dizzy. The amazing bit now. That would reduce my budget, but reduce tension. What is that? That should be good. Christian there, so reliability. Build me two of those. Send a force. Central firing. Hmm. The complete class. Oh, our new ones. Let's rebuild them. Central firing. Yeah, I know. Let's be, they were rebuilt in 1901. They're not too bad. They're new. Take you to central firing. You've got a ton of weight left. I'm in a bunch more. Central firing. Couple of fire positions. Kind of torpedo defense. Off arm of the turrets a little bit. Placing the machine would help. Yeah, good secondaries. Yeah, that's fine. Build those two. It's only for like six months or so. We can eat that. That's fine. Uh, yeah, we'll take turrets and gun mountains. Oil firing. That is major. Right, the Oldenburg is a battleship, but it's going to be massively outdated. Yeah, everything's everything's changing at the moment. We'll clip closure on the ships to Japan. Not taking the prestige here. Triple turrets. Alright. Yeah, we need some more stuff on fire stations. 
Coming up, that will solve that problem. We have no allies left. And the battleship race is completely on. We're not doing too badly though. Everyone else is building one or two. <clears throat> it's only Great Britain who's steaming ahead. We're four months out from that rebuild. Just need more cash. Thank you if I missed it. Suppress all social propaganda. Uh, let's send a note to Russia about stealing our technology we bought off the Japanese. Okay. Don't have a war with Germany. Superimposed X turrets. Yeah, the next battleship we build is going to be so much better than the Liberty class. So on the edge of a war as well. Bring you guys up to the active fleet. Gonna cost me. Two degrees in heavy construction. War's broken up being great Britain and Germany. Britain has sunk the armored cruise at a loss of it. Cause that, that is a good engagement for them. Lots of ships getting rebuilt. Central firing is now a thing. But these cannot class. They've just been rebuilt. Central firing with two fire positions. One fire position. To improve secondary guns. More powerful 11 inch secondaries. They're too poor quality to be upgraded. In the Connor class, I'm just going to leave. Only the fourth class is what I designed. So hopefully, yeah, the more powerful 8 inch guns on there, central firing, placing the machinery makes it cheaper, and I'll just sneak an extra knot into it, it cost us 1000 a month, 12 months, not worth it. It didn't make it cheaper, it just moved to zero across. More powerful 8 inch guns. No, it does make it cheaper. 1,000 a month for 3 months. Okay, so that makes it cheaper in the long run. But we're not dealing with the long run here. We're just trying to get some battleships out. It's going to cost us, but it's only for three months. And that will give those 13 inch guns a much better chance of hitting. It's in USA, 900 ton destroyers. British have lost a battleship and a light cruiser for a Corvette. And we're just sitting here on the edge of a wall. Got the intelligence on those guys. And uh, let's finish the construction. Mm, can't manage it. Much less like another four bin. No prestige, no concessions with Germany.
just touching this. There's two new battleships. Ooh. Well, whatever is due, we're going to increase tension, so we must well just fully push the tension. Well, the first world war starting ten, five years early, June seven, eight. Yeah, war with Germany is a bit inevitable at this point. Everybody's ready. Budget is up. What was 900 ton destroyer cost us? 300 a month. Oil and turbine. 32 knots. Yeah, that's fine by me. And we should hopefully be able to buy a few of those. We're still not at war, that we're at war. First thing we're going to do is I'll look through these. Okay, that hit. Very close to the nine months away from the battle cruiser right now. That's Germany. They've got 21 battleships. Wow, I did not catch that. We're in actually a little bit of trouble. We've got how quickly Germany can build up. Right, trade protection, cruiser battle. Uh, should be okay with that. Okay, one well, known ship sighted. Move to engage. That's a heavy German line coming in. A superior French economy we should hopefully deal with it. The first shots the third Franco German line war. The German took the first hit. Yep, yeah, we're hitting that German class quite hard, but there's little destroyers are coming in for an assault. That one just took three eight inch guns to the face. He didn't hit once a second battery, but we're doing some good hits. If we're penetrating or not, I don't know. Oh, that's turret A. Gaidon taking a good amount of fire. I would take a torpedo to the face. One of our torpedoes is out. Looking good. Yeah. Now we have the successful torpedo assault of the war. Of the game, actually. Also, when I'm on fire for a second. The Berman class are old. These are definitely the war class. I've got the armor ability. Your flotation is under control. Right, can you sweep into somewhere? Let's put Porthau in the second uh, row. Is that the leader of the Porthau class? You're one of my most modern armored cruisers, so. Hopefully. Limits flooding, that's what I'd like to be. Here come the destroyers again. Oh my god, magazine hit. Both our voice torpedoes. That was unlucky. Alright. We have lost this. I think it is time to try and break contact. Looking at the back there. 
Flotation damage, but you know flooding, so let's go back to max speed. Now 15. Plus I was taking some hits. And we took another torpedo. Let's go see if we can... Uh, yes, to all. Main destroyers are being exceptionally useless. Oh, that's near maximum flotation damage. Getting some good hits on this Bremen class, though. profile looking. You're not too bad. You drop your speed down. We need to keep you as float if possible. This one has gone terribly. Hopefully the poor file can finish off this Bremen class. Taking hits. Oh, there we go. We got our range on the permit. That five inch armor is not going to be a match for the uh, 10 inch. Yep, something in five. Let's see if we can see them, we can kill them. Yep, I'm not surprised. They have enough armor cruisers before this started. Night will save me. Just want to sink this thing. There we go, she's gone. Big contact. Sink off into the night, licking our wounds. Those 300 ton destroyers are not worth their existence anymore. But if I scrap them in mid war, it's going to be a bit bad for me. Right. Oh, two heavy cruisers lost. One light cruiser, they lost one armoured cruiser. That's a, a shocking defeat for us. Yeah, no. Definitely, definitely when I should have lost some points on that. My shells are getting better. Information dominating around Senegal and their blockade. Yes, awesome. Why are you coming back to Northern Europe? Why are you heading to North Asia? This is going to be a tough one. Yeah, that's two more cruisers. Get me how much cruisers I can lose in a day. Because if this we make contact here, it's going to be a nice fight. Oh. Where are they? Oh, right there. I think we got some torpedoes off. But we are right in the middle of destroyers. Murder them, murder them quick.
Right, we select the race for a class. There's a Vermin, Vermin and a York class up there. Get those destroyers away from us. Ah, oh, there's a charmer just to get hit. Right. Start breaking for all. The Germans have got the destroyer advantage on us. Oh, and the Monk Khan just got rammed. And well for the destroyer, but also actually don't for the Monk Khan just basically just slammed through that thing. Just slowed it down in front of the enemy fleet. Let's see if we can disengage. Now the Earl of Chandra's losing ground, but she with alarm, she's a newer ship as well. Oh, the Republican sub is coming. The monk can't can come engage with the help then. Oh, now the germs are running. Yeah, they're just properly racing away from me now. They're able to two battleships. Yep, just keep up and it's just because we're getting a few spots. Because they're just on the edge of visibility. York here seems to have lost some speed. Oh, that's a good solid hit, but we just took an engine into the not calm. Oh, they got, they have got engine in each other. I think we just took out a rudder though. Alright, that makes up for losing. Nice solid hit. Yeah, well, China was thinking, yeah, so we basically traded the ships. Not surprised. Not surprised in the light. Let's go. I think this medium. Oh, we do have to sort that merchant. Just a little bit snowy outside. I don't want to go tiny, but I'm sure I'd bash me unless I have to. Well, it's a big trip. Oof. Ooh, that's an expensive one. Yeah. That's as marginal as you can get. German DD Sonka Submarine. Uh, two of our ships has failed to return. Uh, built ships. Another three destroyers. Another cruiser battle. Try bombardment target. We know there's one near the mouth of this, don't we? Need the points at this point. Right. Oh, that's a eleven inch. This could be interesting. Oh, we've got the hits on her. Uh... 
Hope these three heavy cruisers should be able to enjoy the thing in good time. I think you guys are always becoming dependent units. Just a mess with me, isn't it? Yeah, take out an 11 inch coastal blaster is quite important for a future invasion. Burning and not really returning fire now. This person butter is a big stationary target, so you should be able to nuke them. There we go. That not count? What about the six inch? Not within a hundred nautical miles of the target or something stupid like that. Never find cold steel batteries that much use, so I don't tend to build them. Probably should build more. Maybe I don't find any use because I don't build enough. It's not burning anyway. That's still fine back. Take some pounding to destroy, don't they? Our car keeps getting hit in the engine room. Come on, blow the thing up. Want me twelve thousand points? There we go. That's disengaged. Apparently, it's not going to give us the point. Okay, and so yeah, we failed to destroy one bomb on target, but we destroyed two line targets, which apparently gives us points. I don't know. Losing the wall so far. Right, British and Germany still sinking each other. Alright. We get two new light cruisers. That's the point, we've got a bunch of raiding cruisers here. We should be raiding. Light forces. Unknown ship sighted. Ramp up the speed. I go in full, full throttle. Make a good hit on that VD class. V3 to stop from serious hits. Getting a hit into this uh, Neopi class. Right. Chance of torpedoing it. Oh no, the bush there is being annihilated. <coughs> right. 
Ah ouais, pas bah ici. Losing another ship. Just destroyers. I've got tons of those. It's not a good time to misunderstand signals. Oop. A magazine here. New flag. Flee. Flee as quickly as you can. Goes out there. Come on. And the scenario. And the scenario. Another stinker. Four winners of cars. Yes. Never more for better than that. Fire control. Huh? We're both blockading each other. Uh, you guys got on to radar status. These are only a couple of months out of the bus group. Uh, auto resolve. No, my small quality 12 inch guns. Still being blockaded. Let's design a new red bot. Now it sounds a bit crazy, but hear me out. 12 inch guns. Yep. 18 knots is a bit slow. I can't build a 20 knot. Curse you. Central firing. 9 inch armor is a bit on the low side. The belt. About as big as we can build, exactly. Alright. Let's go with the Justice then. She's cold and turbine. All in turbine I think would be better. Bit more expensive. But wouldn't, wouldn't lose speed for stokers. Okay. Four months by that point. Liberty, democracy, democracy and all that should be done. Oh, good convoy defence. Neo Geo. No, no transports already. Good Neo Geo is slow ship. Come on, rescue the convoy. There she is. So we've lost a much about two on cruises. Oh, we've got a couple of hits since the York class. Come on, launch the torpedoes. Torpedo out. Ah, your FO exit. See, these guys have only got 4 inch belt armor. Oh, and you've lost your forward code. Yeah, we can't 
in this one. Yeah, it destroys difficult and survivors. Oops, now just going down. Nothing she can do about this. She's lost too much speed at this point. Those guys want to kill her, they kill her. Yeah, she's dead. Yeah, I know. I guess they'll do already. Maybe she didn't die to save the, uh... On it. The children. The merchant doesn't look like it. <clears throat> this toy is a new flag force. Come on, make a torpedo strike. Nope, nope, just getting exploded. Nice and nice, we can make it. Uh, yeah, go past fast. Hopefully, the combo will make it. I'll destroy it. Yeah, the company, most of the company made it. But, oh, we took a victory on that. Only because we got most of the convoy home. Oof. It's not going to graze down the land either. Do whatever is 500 per month and a prestige hit. To get working torpedoes, yes. Yep, crush. Well, ally. I will formally crush Germany. We've got a thousand coming in. Which is good. Because they're just fine. Bloody under justice is coming up. And I want to build as many of those as I can. This me attacking a convoy. Yes, it must be me attacking a convoy. The run four is a very, very... Okay, that looks more like a convoy up there. Up oh, squadron max. Ultra fast. Fast then. I don't know, I'll just transport in there, but it's not going to help them. Well, oh, look at that, hits coming in on the side. The Melampus is the one with the stupid number of 5 inches on it. It is designed to slaughter convoys like this. You think? Go for the arm merchant men at the bottom. Let not survive. Right, let's case this new be class as well. Uh, no to that. We're about to engage. The actual German fleet. Oh, the Lieutenant will be hit. That's unlucky. Oh, the only new Ubi class will be hit. Apparently, that 500 a month for that hill. We are losing ships at an amazing rate. I'm not entirely sure who's winning this one. I 
Are you running a smoke screen or is that just the graphics? Just the graphics blitz. Ching, it's fine. The mallard is sinking. Tony is sinking. I guess that one earlier. Oh, Malacampus is sinking. Arpus is sinking. Oh, it's been a very bloody day at sea. The little ships really got in there, didn't they? Honestly, it's probably best off just disengaging. We've done as much damage as we're going to be able to do. Second piece screen for a second. They are not giving up on hunting down these destroyers, are they? Night should come soonish. Four o'clock in the afternoon. in the game. We explored Death Fleet, then the lost most of ours. Stupid non decisive engagements between light ships. Doing the Nemesis and the mis Minstrel are going to do well. Not getting hit though, are they? Still fighting. Oh, enemy destroys it by torpedo. There's not going to be much left of that. If it was just a destroyer. Alright. So we lost three light cruisers and two destroyers, but came out on top thanks to the. Um, 12,000 points of sinking transports. Gain of prestige, and lost half my fleet. Yep, another industrial boost. Yes, another month for that, that's fine. More budget, four satellite turrets, 14 inch guns. Lost the battleship. British lost the battleship. Hmm. Right, got a huge amount coming in. Two months till the Justice class is ready. Our first dreadnoughts will be out soon. Let's build two more light cruisers. 
Mm. Yeah, my list of ships and services dropped quite dramatically. After the war, things are going to get a bit interesting. We may have to go heavy on the lights and heavy. I need to rebuild the entire fleet at this point. The entire fleet is obsolete. And they will not give me the cash I need to do that. Uh, so, I'm going to call it there because I don't want to get dragged into another fight. Thanks for watching as always, and I'll see you next time.